<laughs> Yo, so today I I just saw actually something very interesting and I just had to share this. So this is a prophet a bed a bed nego. Uh probably I'm sure most of you have watched his video and or subscribed to his platforms. Actually, the way I came to know uh prophet a bed, let me just first of all just uh, get that get it out there. Is there was a time I was watching a video and he was actually criticizing Prophet Lovi. So I was like, hey, who's this guy who's criticizing Prophet Lovi? And then uh, I remember that time even Prophet Lovi came out and he was he was quite furious. He even wanted to press charges against uh, Prophet Abed and all that. So that is just a story of another day. But today there's something I just, I just saw these dreams masterclass. Yo, 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 yo. So first of all, I didn't know that uh, dreams currently, uh, <laughs> there's a masterclass of dreams. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Actually, it just reminds me of another story. Uh, there was someone, there was a, actually a man of God I was speaking to, and he was telling me that uh, there's someone in their neighborhood who just opened a prophet school. So you, you're, you're going to be taught on how to be a prophet in that school and everything. And then after that, you're actually certified. And then uh, there's a graduation for you. And then now you're a prophet. So you can imagine in that neighborhood how many prophets are there. So it just becomes like uh, this prophet is prophesying on this one and that. But that's just crazy. And you can find there are so many people actually regis registering for such kind of things and doing. And it's just crazy and outrageous. Uh, just things that are happening currently. But um, the way uh, how to be a prophet that is a story for another day that's just a story for another day but let us get into these dreams masterclass because this has brought a lot of uproar online and actually uh, it brings in a lot of questions first of all uh, i remember there's a video as well by prophet abed and he was again his passion java because you know passion java uh, on his website he actually gets to sell um I, I, those images he sells those images so you get a price and then you buy those images and i think uh i haven't really followed on that but i think you're supposed to i think jay you're supposed to place those images i think when you touch those images or something you see but i don't know something like that so prophet abed was actually against that and i was like yo cool cool but now here in this dreams master class which is supposed to be another way for him probably just to preach the gospel and everything because freely you've received whatever you've received i think you should freely give it but now you can see there they're saying registration required they're actually charging he's actually charging he's charging the gospel and then he just said that all proceeds uh, go towards the advancement of the ministry first of all this is actually a zoom class so zoom is not his personal website what he's actually uh the only thing that he's going to be charged here are bundles if he's going to use bundles or data or is but if he's going to use wi-fi definitely if it's a subscription he has to pay for that so there's no way uh there's no so i don't see where i don't see how that applies especially to this ministry maybe if he's talking about him receiving those funds and then placing them in whatever ministry he's talking about so that is the first thing that is actually the first thing. But this, I'm telling you, it has brought a lot of APRO online. So here, this is another slide, just uh, people, guys, who are commenting on, on his post. So someone is saying here, it's called by Danny M. He says, be very careful when someone tells you they'll teach you how to interpret dreams regardless of who they are. Always fall on God's word, not man's word. Let God be true, every man a liar. Joseph was one of the greatest dream interpreters that lived a gift from god but even he said in genesis uh, 48 and they said unto him we have dreamed a dream there is no interpreter of it and joseph uh, do do not all interpretation belong to god tell me that yeah so so that is uh, actually danny so danny according to danny if you read more according to danny danny uh, is saying dreams there's no way that you can actually be taught about dreams but rather on how to interpret dreams for someone and all that he's saying that is if it's a gift then d definitely that is coming from god so another one is saying hypocrisy at his best you're slandering other false pers personas while doing the same thing may the lord forgive you all and then someone else said he just wanted to gain popularity 
using their names. Uh -huh. <laughs> he just wanted to gain popularity. Yeah, because the truth is, according to Prophet uh, Abed, like so many people, he always like, he's always like, hey, yo, this person is fake. This person is fake because he's doing that. And the way he explains it sometimes when you listen to him, you're like, yeah, for me, it, uh, yeah, for me, you got a point there. But now uh, looking at him, now he's the one who's charging. He's the one now who's putting a, actually a price tag on the gospel. Then, then definitely that raises a whole lot of question. So this one say, hello, prophet. Can you please cut the price in half? Imagine this person, I think, uh, isn't able to afford whatever amount it was. I'm not sure what it what he's charging so you can find these for free from well-known men of god look uh, up robert clancy and kevin ewing freely you receive freely give so that one is just telling him hey this information is already out there so relax uh why discourage someone those who are well known started here as well it's a clear sign you shouldn't be attending this class suggestion and uh, what you have give is to the needy so someone else is defending and saying it's going to the ministry. But you see, uh, the APRO online, there's a lot of APRO out here. There's a lot of APRO. People are just in confusion because, you know, uh, Prophet Abed is known for his boldness of actually just terming other men of God as false. So I think when you call others false, then definitely you are supposed to be the real one. But then uh, the real one now is starting to act like the fake ones. Why is then, why are you charging? are you charging yo i don't know so he was using their name so that uh he can be known someone else said that and it's called caroline and then some caroline said again he is copying other prophets messages while cutting half of their messages to slander then the important ones he is now starting to request zoom meetings hypocrisy so actually what uh, caroline is talking about is saying that he's saying that uh, she's saying that prophet abed is actually just picking points that make the other men of God to look bad. Uh, just try to make a name for himself. And now, since now he's made a name for himself, he's now charging for Zoom meetings, guys. So, <laughs> yeah, so I've just read some of your comments about this, but uh, I don't know what you guys think about this. But according to me, if this is a Zoom meeting, I don't see why. I don't see why he's supposed to charge. I think... His interest should be more on actually uh, having many. If this is information that children of God really need, why do you charge for it? Yet it's just a Zoom meeting. Why don't you actually, you could even put it out here for YouTube because so many people, uh, you have people who are following you on YouTube. Why not just put it out there for YouTube, have that post and say, you know what, this day, let's do this, uh, talk about these dreams. And I love to join as well. I love to be part of it, but if it's in an open forum bless the kingdom of god bless god's children and definitely that's how god uh, rewards you but i don't know why you're going now on that direction of starting to church so that is us that is one of the things that uh, prophet abed used to be against so what else did the prophet abed used to be against and now he is the one practicing so that is something that we are just waiting to see but sometimes just the way they say it, they say that time tells it all. So let us watch and let us see. Let us keep watching and we will see. Okay, guys. So see you on the next video.